Aloy, I told you I'd be here. You did, Teb. But have your wounds even had time to heal? Honestly, if I fought, I'd probably come undone. But don't worry. I'll leave that to the other Nora at the Spire. I brought supplies instead. These Karja have made me an honorary quartermaster, whatever that means. <laughs> it sounds impressive. I could get used to it. We'll be setting up caches of arms and medicine under these banners. Look for them when the fighting starts. Aloy? When you went into the mountain, did the goddess tell you our chances? She didn't need to. I know we can do this, Teb. Maybe we can. An Osram tries to kill the Sun King, and a Nora saves his life. I wouldn't believe it if I hadn't seen it with my own eyes. Greetings, Aloy. Don't. You don't need to bow. The Anointed doesn't like it. She doesn't much like being called Anointed, either. It means a lot to have you here, Varl. I gave my word. So, Meridian, what do you think? I've seen... many new things since I first met you. I should thank you. Varl, what's wrong? You really want to know? All right. I'm in a foreign land, a tainted land, defending a faithless city that looks like nothing I've seen. From something I can't imagine. And you, after all that's happened, all you've done, I feel like I should drop to my knees and worship you, but I know you don't want that. Boy, things are pretty tough for you, huh? Thanks for telling the other Nora not to bow. It's the last thing I need. <laughs> don't be too hard on them. They only joined this fight because the Anointed bid it so. Is that why you came? No. I would have come just to see you one more time. And we must fight a metal devil because the Goddess says, or because you say. I think the Goddess and I are in agreement. We're both glad you're here. So am I. It rises taller than the highest tree. These cards are in their frilled armor look like turkeys. But there are so many. And now we are so few. They are not our foe. Not this time. Quiet now. She comes. The Anointed? War Chief Sona. 
War Chief, you... you seem uncomfortable. The Nora do not belong here. I do not belong here. I will fight the Metal Devil that threatens us all, but my place is in the Sacred Land. The wrongness here jags at me like an arrowhead. I'm sorry to put you through this. My spear, my word. So who are these guys? They call themselves the Eclipse. What does that even mean? It's when the moon gets in front of the sun, idiot. Is that supposed to sound scary or something? I don't know. They used to be Karja. Karja are always yammering about sun and shade. Well, if they used to be Karja, how tough can they be? Yeah, they're best guys, just like birds. We'll rip their little feathers off. And let's not get cocky, boys. Aloy, <laughs> so here we are again, gearing up for a fight. Only this time it sounds like the bad guys have a lot more firepower. What are we up against, really? I'm not sure. But there's gonna be a lot of them, and they'll have machines. And if they get past us, it's not just Meridian that will fall. The rest of the world will go with it. Well, that's... big. It sounds like our kind of fight. Right, guys? Well, where do they put the vanguard? At, At the, the front, front of the line! line! And why? Steel before iron! And what are we gonna do? Hit him like a hammer till he can't hit, hit back. back! Damn right! You hear that? Nobody's getting past the vanguard. We're here for Meridian. And we're here for you. Thank you, Erend. Ursa would be proud. Only if we win.